Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. We have been food shopping. My husband's stirring me up. <laughs> He's calling me Nikki. I have been called Nikki. Uh, so the people that call me that, I'm like, I've got one auntie who gets away with it, and that's only because I don't see her very often. So it's not your name. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, we went to Woolworths. We actually had to go in and do all the shopping because I was a bit late in getting my order in to go in and pick it up for the drive through So, <laughs> the times... No, nah, the times were still on there when I started doing the shopping, but by the time I got to the end of it... Yeah, they were, the only one left was pick up at 4 to 5, which would have been fine. It's 5.20 now, and we have not long left. Yep. What time did we work out we're going to get home? About quarter 6.30. 6.30, yeah. Quarter to 7. The Woolies, and then we went to Aldi. And then we picked up pizzas. They're so good. We were just having some then. I've been loving the. I can't think, tomato. Of, I can't think what it's called. It's got, yeah, just fresh tomato and oregano. It's so good. No, it's not Vegerama. It's called something else. I don't remember after. Vegesaurus. <laughs> okay, it's not Vegesaurus. <laughs> um, and then. Yeah, we're like. Wizlack. <laughs> Wizlack. Oh. Yeah, we better hurry up and get home. We plan on leaving home at 9.30. I originally said, oh, we'll leave home at 9. We'll get there by, you know, 11. But it didn't work out like that. <laughs> yeah. But it's all right. This hasn't been... We haven't had a rush. It's been quite good. Oh, and we called in to Repco. James has got something going on with his car, so some parts that we need to get that sorted when we get home we'll show you everything that we got we didn't spend as much as we as we normally do <laughs> i'm so tired just said james i didn't get much of a good sleep last night that's us coming back up yeah that's the bus there that goes from perth to geraldton I've unpacked most of my normal groceries on the table and I just need to get the cold stuff in the fridge quick because there was some stuff in the bag that didn't go in a cold bag or esky so I've got to get that in the fridge ASAP. Got two blocks of parmesan cheese, we've got some pastrami and some hot Hungarian salami and I've got some tofu as well. So this is my Aldi bag, we've got some healthy noodles in there, a big four litre orange juice. I've got two blocks of real butter, more hockey noodles. So I think that's what I've got four of those. I've got one block of tasty cheese, two tubs of vanilla yogurt. Okay, in the esky we have a white chocolate mud cake, a couple of punnets of blueberries, three punnets of Strawberries, they were from Woolies, and so were the blueberries, that was all from Woolworths, that, that bit there. Got a pack, few packs of the stir fry, they're new at Aldi. Got a couple of boxes of chicken nuggets, they were half priced at Woolworths. 
It's got some blino, tomatoes, some Aldi, some sour cream. Here's my other pack of hokey noodles. We got some chili garlic stuffed olives. Just bang up some of those. And the deli and Woolworths. We've got some Greek cheese, feta cheese for my salads. And we've got some more floney. I normally only get two of them, but Hutter Wolves asked for these, so I'm sorry. I'll check the date, and then they're pretty good for a while, so grab four of them. Grab some more sliced light cheeses, light cheese, brother, for myself. And I grabbed this rosemary and garlic beef brump. Right, this looks really good. Ten ninety nine a kilo is pretty cheap too, so cook that up. I've got a big pack of bacon that I usually get from Aldi. It's like ten bucks. Uh, we got a couple of chooks from Aldi as well. Same as usual. And from Woolworths, I got a kilo. Oh, two kilos chicken breast. Hmm. Oh, I thought I wanted. We got a kilo, but that's okay. And I also got some. They're chicken thighs, but they're skin on, and they've got the bone in them. And they're quite big ones. They're five fifty a kilo. So I said to lady, just do the six of those. It would be enough for one each for everybody. And um, got some beef blade steak. It's going to be for a meal I'm going to make this week. And we've got some rump steak from Woolies as well. And I also picked up a two kilo mince from Aldi as usual. And frozen veggies. Got the spring greens mix of be beans, peas and broccoli. Garden mix, I love this one. Broccoli, beans, carrot, cauliflower. And broccoli, I think I said broccoli. Capsicum, rather. Uh, frozen Brussels sprouts and a bag of corn cobs. And Hado actually asked me could I get some custard when I did the shopping, so got some of that. Okay, guys, let's get into my shopping. I'll show you my woolly stuff first and we'll go buy fresh produce. I've got a lettuce, they're only $1.50, it's a nice big one. And we got some mushrooms marked down, 3.36 instead of six bucks for one. So that's cool, grab two of them. And I grabbed a kilo of the gourmet tomatoes. I'm actually growing those in my own garden, so I can't wait for those to be good. Three bags of brown onions. I've got a bag of avocados. There's a kilo in there and they were like nine dollars. So pretty good value. And I've got some of these baby potatoes. I am sorry, I overbuy potatoes and they're green. Um, these were two bucks a bag. So we first we grabbed three. And then once we went down the other end, we saw these ones. They were the last ones left and they were $4.50. And they look really good. So we grabbed those and we put one of those ones back. Hubby's idea. Um, and over the back there, we've got a big 24 pack of toilet roll, same as usual. And I've got a 12 pack of hamburger buns. I actually called up as soon as the shop opened and said, have you got any? They had two packs. I said, can you please hold me one? Because they never have them when I go there, they drive me nuts. And they have all these trays, half price. I bought some of them a little while back and it's not long till Christmas, so. Start stocking up with those. So I've got two, three packs of the medium ones, and I grabbed one of the ten small ones. So they're a really good size as well. I'm just waiting for the big ones to go on special, and then I'll buy some of those as well. Um, bread rolls. We got some of those like little um, crusty rolls. They're beautiful. I'm gonna actually put them in a Ziploc bag because otherwise they'll be stale by tomorrow. I hate getting the bread when it's got the holes in the pack. It's just yeah, I don't know. I suppose it keeps them crisp in there, just the sort that you need to eat on that day or put them in another bag. And we've got a few packets of just the normal white bread rolls. And then we've got these little tiny lunch rolls. They're a bit cute, 
so that would be good for the kids during the week. On the last week of holidays, and I've got another um, nice crusty loaf of bread. I'm going to make some more bruschetta. I made that the other day and it was so, so good. Um, I've got some rolled oats, two packets of those. And they had the microwave popcorn. I had the sweet and salty, so it's a James Yarm. And they're about five fifty, I want to say, for four bags, so that's not bad. James spotted the chip of butter, <laughs> so he grabbed that one. Uh, the Smith's chips were on special. I want to say like a dollar seventy pack. So we got barbecue chicken, cheese and onion, and a salt and vinegar. And they had the veggie chips on special, so I grabbed a couple of barbecue ones um, with those. Uh, the little boxes of cereal were on special, they were half price, it's $2.30 for a box, which is pretty good. Like it's only a small one, but for that price, it's good. And the cappuccinos were half price again, so we got the last four normal ones and then the four um, of the strong flavour. Sorry if you can hear that chicken in the background. I'm ready to wring its little neck. It's just, oh god, it just does it all day. Um, okay, what we got down this way, I'll come back over here. I've got a box of gravy and we've got some more burger sauce. I've got some beef burgers in the freezer, so that will be on my menu plan this week. And I've got a few things for sandwiches this week. I'm all out of like things that go with meats and that for hubby's lunches and dry for when they're working. So I've got a mango chutney, I got a hot tomato chutney. Uh, that's just my burger pickles. Some garlic aioli. I was buying some aioli from Aldi and didn't like it at all. So I said, oh, I'm going to buy the Heinz one. But you've got to give it a go, you know. It could be good. In this case, it really wasn't. <laughs> um, and they had these uh, paddocks on special. So I got two of the buttered chicken ones and we got two of the korma paste ones, so they'll be good. And we've got corn relish as well for Sangers. And I've got a couple of the whole grain mustards. I've got one of the Woolies brand one. I know it tastes the same, it just doesn't really look that nice. So I've got one of these as well. This one looks really good. And I've got a big tub of smooth peanut butter. We haven't had any of that for a while. And apple sauce as well. And I picked up a couple of these basil leaves. These were only $1.50. That was pretty good. And I also picked up a Dijon mustard. This is what I'm going to make my dressing with for my Greek salad. It's so good. So all out of that. And my almond spread, they were on special for the 4.50 instead of 5.70, so I grabbed two of those. And I also got a Promite. I've got one in my pantry, but I lost the lid. I don't know where it went, so I actually covered it with glad wrap, and it's just yuck. So I'm not using that. Um, a big jar of fruit chutney. This one's really good. This one's really good in curry, too. Do you want to do a nice sweet curry? Beautiful. Um, down in here, I've got some more saffron when I do my curries. And I picked up a couple of these Nando's rubs. This is just the medium one. I had a bottle of the marinade in my basket when I was doing my shopping. But I said to Hobby, I got two of these for less than what one of those bottles cost me, so I'm gonna. Give that a go, I reckon that'll be really yummy. And Quest Bars were like 2 70 normally four bucks, so I've got a couple of the chocolate chip cookie dough ones, my favourite. And I've got a couple of beef stroganoff packs as well, that's going to be on the menu this week. And I got some of the mini MMs, they were on sale for a dollar, and I'm putting those away for Christmas droppings. And they also had these little Alien pops, it's like a little, it's like a ring, ring pop. That's Valley Poo one, the Hardo one. There's the thing. 
And I've got some Pringles, sour cream and onion. That one's special for two bucks, so I've got two of those. And I've got four little cans of the water chestnuts. I love putting those in the curries. We all really like them. So, and they're like a dollar ten for a tin, so that's pretty good. Got some tomato juice to drink. Love the stuff. And the coleslaw dressing, that was two dollars a bottle, so I've got two of those. Um, we've got some large Ziploc bags. We've got some new tongs. I've already got one pair of these. They're not as long as these ones. So hubby said, do some more of those? Like, yep. And I've got a new peeler. I love these peelers. They're so good. I'm pretty happy with that. We've got one big block of chocolate. And I grabbed the uh, monthly magazine as well to have a gander at and I've got this little brush so that I can get right in the corner of my bathroom tiles my brush that I've got now is not cutting it at all <laughs> it's playing the bum um, I got these dishwasher tablets these are not actually for my dishwasher there is another vlog coming that I'm gonna do and yeah it's just a hack that I saw during the week sometime and I thought I'm going to give it a go and it blew my mind, literally. Um, yeah, I rang, rang everybody. So stay tuned for that one. You'll be thanking me later, I promise you. Uh, I got some more white vinegar. I just love doing my poached eggs and tipping a little bit of vinegar in with them. When you cook them or even after, it doesn't really matter. And I covered this up because I've got some things in here for Missy Moon. So I bought her a new water bottle. This was like five bucks, half price. And that's so cool, it's got some little um, band things that she can take off and put on her wrist and that. That's pretty cool. And I've got some deodorant, so one for me, one for Missy Moo. Three for the boys as usual. They'll just go in the storage bit anyway, and if they need some deodorant, they can ask me and I'll give them one. Um, we got a big two litre fountain sauce. James did not want me buying the cheap brand of sauce. He's like, nah, it just tastes gross, so don't get it. Um, a couple of toilet ducks. We got a tropical sunshine and citrus, so they should smell nice. And I've got these for Missy Moo. These are for Christmas. Um, these were half price too, so cool little shaver there. It actually like foams up as well. And then this is the refills for it, so that we put away for Christmas for her. And then I got her some of these ones for now as well. They're pretty nice. A couple of toilet ducks. These ones are really good, like I said to you before. I don't like the cage ones because the boys pee all over. And they had these ice bricks on sale. They were uh, two pack was three fifty. So I grabbed a few more of those. And just got some more penny liners as well. And that's about it for my Woolworths one and all the other stuff that we saw already. And going on to my Aldi end, we got two of these 24 packs of water. I really, really hate the water here. I'm really struggling with it. <laughs> it's so bad. Um, yeah, so James is like, not get one of them. And I pretty much drank a whole bottle on the way home. It was so nice. I just, yeah, I just really don't like the idea of all those bottles. That's not anything that normally stops me from buying all the time. Um, milk wise, we got two cartons of the light and we got um, the big ones. So a better value, they were $2.29 for two litres, and only about $1.30 or something for one. So I saved a little bit of money. Um, we didn't get too many because we are going down to Perth next weekend. So we can get more then. Um, I've got a pack of brown rice, more drinking chocolate, a couple of cans of corn, some strawberry jam. Um, I've got a couple of packs of wraps here. So these ones are the large white wraps and these ones are the little mini white ones. And we've got six loaves of bread. They didn't have the bread that I normally get. I've never actually seen this one before, untouched by human hand. Interesting. Um, so we grabbed six of those, that, that'll be enough just to last a week till we go down again. And I've got some more stock cubes, we've got two boxes of chicken and a beef. 
And I've got some more spaghetti. I actually had a lot of spaghetti in my pantry, but the mice got into a lot of them. So I had to throw them out, obviously. So I grabbed a couple of those. And the last bit of it is, I've got some more produce, but I've got some breadcrumbs here. Um, but yeah, fresh produce wise, I just could not wait to go and get some fresh produce. I've got some Granny Smith apples, Hotto loves those. Some pears. We got two packs of the pink lady apples, kilo bags or kilo punnet rather. Um, we got some kiwi fruits, a cucumber, a cauliflower. Those are pretty cheap. Also like two dollars fifty, two dollars seventy, something like that. So yeah, that's not bad. A couple of nice big red capsicums and some bananas and two purple onions and I've got a red cabbage I've got this little bag of mandarins look at these, they're so tiny they're like really little I've got some more tomatoes because I'm going to use these ones for the bruschetta I find these ones are better for the bruschetta because there's not as much seed stuff in them so and I've got one bag of carrots as well it really well because I had my account for my woolies on my phone and I've got it on the computer as well so once I had, had everything in my basket that I was ready to buy um, I just could go on my phone it was all on this deal so I said to hubby that's okay I could look on there and then once we got to woolies it was awesome because I just went started on my list and as I got it, I just crossed off took it off so yeah it was really good um, I definitely do prefer the driveway pick up but wasn't meant to be today so it was all right we managed um, and we also went to chemist warehouse too so I'll show you what we got from there we got this big bottle of vitamin C tablets there's 500 in here and I've got some of these refresh little there's like individual ones in here there for hubby he gets dry eyes and stuff so haven't had them for a while I uh, got some more heel bar. Yeah, so I got one of those. And this is like the big 200 gram tube. Got another bo another bottle of uh, Nurofen tablets. These are such good value. There's 96 tablets in here. And I want to say they were $14. They're normally about 20 in any other chemist, which is a bargain anyway. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Got another uh, little roller thing for my foot machine for your heels and stuff. Oh God, if you've got cracked heels, you seriously need to get onto this and get one of those little machines and your heels will be just beautiful. Summertime's coming, girls, so I'm gonna get your nice shoes out and that without having, you know, like give you cracks on there. Yeah, it's just horrible and they hurt too, so it's not very pleasant. Uh, I've got some butter menthols, they're for me. I've actually been sick, so. Uh, I'm feeling a bit better today on the way up there about half an hour before we got up to the shops so I'm feeling a little bit better. I've been sick for about eight, nine days, so haven't been very well at all. I've uh, got some more hemp seeds as well. I love them, love them on my salad and yeah, anything else. Uh, so I right, this was cheap in there too, it was like $14, it's normally $20 in any other chemist as well. And we also got some Nexium for the heartburn, these are really, really good. So there's like 24 hour ones and there's 14 in there. So that was pretty good. Yeah, so the vitamin seeds were 23.50. The hemp seeds were 5.24. The lactyl heel balm was 23. That will last ages. Uh, next in was $9.50. And it actually says on there too, like, why pay? So anywhere else would be 27.99. The next in was 9.50. Um, the foot roller was 10.99. The eye drop things were $15.99 and the Nurofen's were oh, $16.50. But I've paid $20 for those before. So we spent, uh, we've got all oh, these paper drops were $3.99 and my Zyrex was $14.39. So we spent $123 in the chemist, which is really good for what we got. And in Aldi, we did really well in there actually. We spent $249.69. But in saying that, we did spend a lot at Woolworths. Um, a lot more than normal. 
we spent $592.24. But in saying that, that is including $110 worth of gift cards that are being bought for Christmas. So I'll show you what ones I've got of those for this shop. One is a $30 one and it's ultimate gift for kids. It's got Smiggle, JB, Rebel, Cotton Kids, Bowling, Toy World, Dimmix, Toy Zone, and Kingpin. Which I'm guessing is Bowling, I'm not really sure. And then I've got two Smiggles ones and I've got another trailer EV Games. And the other week when we went down to Perth, I got a $50 Kmart one. And I've already got a couple good little plays, so getting a good little pile going for Christmas, so that's cool. So all up this fortnight, we spent $964.99. Um, I thought we were actually under what we normally spend, but... Like I said, 110 of that was for Christmas, so. And plus the medicines and stuff. That's not too bad. Um, yeah, and that will last quite a bit anyway, so it's all good. Okay, guys, I'm gonna have to get all this stuff put away quick because we've got the fire going in here. And some of this isn't gonna go very good. and It's not cool, so. I hope you enjoyed my fortnightly food shop. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you in my next vlog. Which will be where I show you what I'm going to do with these. Thanks for watching. Bye. Here is a video that my sister Penny sent me of what she bought. This is just her fresh produce. But yeah, it just cracked me up. So I thought I'd add it into the end of my vlog. So this is my version of Nicole. I got some grapes, I got a pumpkin, I got some bok choy, I got a celery, I got some trust tomatoes, I got a lettuce, I got mushrooms, I got broccoli, I got two packs of carrots, I got bananas, I got a bag of spinach, I got two bags of beans, I got a big spinach, I got a cauliflower, some capsicum, Five bags of lettuce, bag of oranges, two pints of strawberries, and a cabbage. <laughs>